things that you know, I wasn't able to do in college. You know, I think I, I showed that I was more explosive than, than what I showed in college, and I think um, just as a defender, I, I, I did pretty good at defense today. What do you need to show uh, to, to make the jump to the NBA? Well, need I don't I don't know about need. I think I think rebounding, rebounding and being quick sort of take care of itself. I think what would make me a better pick, a better drop pick, improve my range as far as the drop. Uh, like you know, being able to handle the ball. Uh, being as big as I am, I look at guys like Zach Randolph and David West. You know, uh, spot up, spot up shooters. I just got to be a consistent with my jump shot and uh, being able to extend my range, but can't get away from. You know, I'm, I was 40 pounds bigger than the guy who was going up against me today, so can't get away from using my body either. How does it feel to be home? Obviously, this is kind of where it all started for you. Now you're realizing your NBA dream. Uh, this is so real. You know, I'm, I'm enjoying the process, but there's no place like home. I mean, I, I love Memphis. You know, it's, I, I get the jitters still coming home, just not even about family or anything. It's just the environment. I, I grew up in this environment. I think Memphis is a very good place. I think uh, a lot of people look at Memphis as, you know, too much crime and first 48 and things like that. But I grew up here. I came out just okay. So uh, I think it's a very good place. You know? I love watching the Grizzlies. This is my favorite team. You know, I, I grew up watching them. Uh, I was a season ticket holder in the uh, nosebleed just three years ago. So it's surreal right now being able to work out for them. So where, where do you see yourself in the next few years? Uh, 